All right, so here is my, I guess my survival sheath or my Falkneven A1. I'm not sure if you guys can actually see that. It's got some use and it's dirty as shit, but. So I got this Kydex sheath from a guy forget his name. I got it a long time ago. I've had this for a long time now. Um, another company is called Apocalypse Gear or apocalypse-gear.com or something like that. It does take a couple months. It took me like, it took like a month to arrive but you know, this guy makes this handmade and he does an amazing job at it. I absolutely love this this um, my little system here. If you're watching this, you probably already know what a fucking even name one is. So it features a belt, uh, a nice quality handmade leather strap that accommodates up to a three inch belt. Or you can use the tech lock. Um, I believe you can use this left handed or right handed. So this is a max condition pouch that that's attached to it. Um, you can stick anything in here from a flashlight, a compass, I don't know, whatever you want. I have a um, a field of sharpening tool. I forgot who makes this. Honestly, I've had it for so long. The red is the fine and the blue is the coarse. And here I have a little striking tool, even though I don't really need it because I have the knife. But I guess it's useful to have with a little bit of what do you call this twine? Just in case I need some um, tinder. On the side, I have a, a fire steel. That's the oh, sorry. Hold on. Wow, I already got this loose. So it comes with a fire loop on the side for a fire steel. And I have it here fire steel. I haven't used it too much. I've used it a few times. It does work. So attached to this, I added some ranger beads. I don't like regular ranger beads. I added some skulls to them. And I believe they glow in the dark. I guess I gotta charge them up and I'll try them out later on for you guys. Um, and that's basically it. I added some some 550 paracord on the side it does not come like that i just bought some paracord and i had i thought it might be useful to have um stuffed inside here i was able to fit a uh, a fresno lens lens in case i need in case i run out of my fire seal which it seems like i have like a billion strikes this is like a 30,000 strike one or i don't remember what it is but so yeah this is a quick just little view of my of my sheath. I really, really, really love my sheath. If you guys want to check them out, Apocalypse Gear, just Google it or go to apocalypse-gear.com. I don't remember how much I paid for this. I think I paid like $90 for it or something like that. Uh, but you know, if my knife cost me, what, $200 or something like that? It should have a nice home, right? My, a little condo for my my falcon. What do you guys think? All right, so here are my here's my ranger beads. 
is, what else can I add? To, I don't want to add a compass to this because the knife, actually, if you have a knife near the compass, it will affect your reading. So I keep that like around your neck. That's a better place for it. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. Thanks a lot, Apocalypse Gear, for my sheath. I've had it for years and I still love it. It's the best, honestly. It's actually bad as fuck. <laughs>